A noble death. Decisive defeat. We've lost everything there. We've lost the Yadda. We must try to retake the Yadda now. An honourable death by Agron. Oh, they only sacked it. It didn't actually take it. That's good because it means that we can retake this. Oh, we can take out the army anyway. Oh, God. It's horrible. Good news is I have an army nearby which can hit them this turn. Give me those war dogs, please. We will be using all of them. And some cav. Two units of cavalry, some mercenary coastal levies. Yeah, we've got quite a big army now. We can attack them there and hurt them. But before that, I have a rebellion to deal with. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here, guys. Right, let's try and work this out. So let's get my army back in the settlement. Oh, they're back in the ship. I don't want that. Get out of the ship. Guys, get in the settlement. Okay. We are replenishing. If they attack me though, I think we could probably hold this, so I'm not too worried about that. We got a navy nearby anyway. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. Do that. Okay, so we're gonna fight this battle now. Antis gets to fight another battle. I get to use war dogs again and ballista. Let's go for it. Let's take out this this army, the blades. Boom. So we do have a garrison, but I doubt it'll be anything. Oh, we've got some people left. That's okay. Let's control the large army. I will see you all on the battlefield. Hey guys, welcome to the battlefield. I will be clicking the stop button now. And as you can see, we have a nice battlefield there right in front of us. We can hit them into the sea, hopefully. I'm going to push them towards the sea anyway. And we're going to try and locate their general a second. There he is. We're going to send all my my ballista to go towards him there. And my cav is on the right flank. I'm going to take them far over the right, right hand side. But they, my dogs are going to go far over to the left. And we've actually got all my reinforcements from the city itself now arriving on the battlefield. So what I will be doing is bringing them forward and use them as bait. Because they're a garrison, it doesn't matter if I lose the garrison or not. That is quite irrelevant indeed. I'm also going to move the full line forward like so. There we go. Hopefully we can get lots of kills with the ballista, which looks like we are at the moment. Haven't taken any hits on the Oath Sworn yet, unfortunately. But that's okay. Loads of skirmishers here, which we're going to go for. Well, two units of skirmishers anyway. We're going to send the two units of cavalry to take them out. Let's get this main line up close and personal to them. And the war dogs, I think I will release them shortly as well. Yeah, let's just send the war dogs in now straight away. Release the hounds. And this will be good indeed. Get those dogs going. Cavalry is incoming shortly. Send two units of levies out. Like so. Take out the skirmishers there. This is going to be good. They don't stand a chance, do they? Use the whip to get in there quickly. Use the whip to get in there quickly. One card for these, one card for them. They're gone. That was nice. That was very good indeed. The war dogs have been sent in right now. Here they go. Oh my goodness gracious me. Look at that. Oh, he got tripped over. That's not good for him. War dog is going to just wreak havoc. <laughs> He's actually going for the general, which is quite good. I'm glad we've gone for the general. Get a quick reload on. Let's just get in there. Let's get the quick reloads going. How are we doing over here? Over here this is where we are. Let's take out the light horse. Let's just take everything out. Bring the coastal levies forward. And now I think we can move the rest of the line 
forward like so. Oh, we're losing our, uh, our reinforcements are not doing very well. Didn't expect them to, to be honest, but it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. I'm going to get up to hit this big pile, Ballista. I'm going to reform all my men as well. Like so. Yeah, this is good. War dogs are completely, <laughs> completely harassing the general here. It's quite funny, actually, to watch. Let's get the missile swing over here instead. Hit them in all directions. Send them all in. Envelop, surround, and kill. The war dogs are still running around. <laughs> The old spawn are divided. Just get them all in there. Get the men in it to reinforce as well if possible. We hunger for blood on the battle. Let's get the ballista. Might actually take one or two shots myself. Try and get one or two kills if possible. We. Oh, that was kind of lame. That was kind of rubbish. I'll give up on the shooting for now. Chase all these men in. Charge the slingers. Hit the three minutes on the way reinforcing. I think the general's dead. Or at least he's routed. I don't know. Can't see him anyway. Just a big mosh pit now of units let's go for the freeman down there let's just chase these that's right get lots of kills get lots of kills guys quick reload levy freeman are wavering the men are wavering bring the war dogs forward as well I think that's the battle won, guys. It looks like it. Victory! So we'll end the battle there. It was a close victory. Excellente! War Dogs did quite well. 97 kills, 107 kills, and 76 kills. Ballista as well did a pretty good job. One of the Ballista had 222 kills. Jesus, that was quite a big, big number. Can enjoy the victory music and we can all do a victory dance together get off my land you fools right we will release the captives because that actually helps your diplomatic relations if you do that a few times and we could probably chase them down with this army no we can't reach them okay we just just settle down in my in my settlement for now fortunately we've held on to my settlement Plus five melee attack. Go for. Let's see. We got lots of cunning. We've got seven cunning actually. We could do with some authority. So we're going to go for plus one authority. It's pretty good general. This guy. Lots of lots of traits. War cry. Second wind. Battle rhythm and inspire. And these guys are almost dead and buried. Now what I'm going to do is quickly check the diplomacy. And see if these guys are at war with anybody else. I don't think they are. It would be nice if I could get the score DC to come on my side. So I will. See if I can I get something with them. How about trade? Non-aggression. Uh, join war against the Brucci. I will help you in your war with the Getai. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Worth a shot, I, I assume. Anyway, this is going to be the next battle. But this will be in the next part. So, I hope you all enjoyed. Again, let me know in the comments below how you think my audio quality has been with the new microphone. And if there's anything you think I need to change. I've been Dragonheart, hope you've all enjoyed, until next time, goodbye.